Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. We are working on the bourbon. The suburban. The suburban, Junior and I. And we're digging into our friendly suspension as I just yanked off the front shocks. Uh, we're gonna put in these new bangled Bilsteins, but um, this, these are the old ones. This is the old ones, yeah. And as I push down on these, I'll show you. Hard. They're super hard the way to push down. Yeah, and see, they don't really come back up very fast. But those ones are brand new, though. Yeah, you're gonna have a tough time pushing on those. Those are pretty solid. Yeah. Yeah. But so that one needs a twist. Those are original shocks, so they're pretty shot. They're coming up slow but sure, but that's definitely worn out, right? So so pretty handy. You just use the uh, cordless impact, long extension, dropped it down here, and then got underneath here and did the same thing popped it out right through there so we will do more of this and junior is going to do some of the camera work so stay tuned guys Guys, also these are new parts for the new shock. Okay, so we gotta get the the washer and a nylock nut on it. So these have a little knurled edge, and then this is a flat piece, right? So those hidden on like that. Yeah, just to make sure that I'm doing this right here. Let's ah. Uh, it's in Deutsch, I believe, Please. because just like this, see how these two things right there, so like these, these nubs like that sandwich the metal. Yeah, but this one looks a little thinner right here, guys. Does it? Well, it's going to go like that, and it's going to go like that, and it's even on both sides. And so, actually Are you this... the camera? Because, yeah. And this one... And this side yeah. are both the same, but these are a little, the front one is a little bigger than the sock. Yeah, so it's a lot different. I think this nylon thing, I think that's just for holding this thing together. I don't know. I don't know. But Maybe it's just for this thing or something. Yeah. I don't think that's supposed to go on. I think it's just like that. Unless it's supposed to be a. Are you sure that's the same or? Yeah, it's it. I believe so. I'm sure of what's just... Take that off or not. I think I've done these Philstines before and had that same question too. Well, what question? I don't know if you're supposed to take that nylon washer off or not. I think it was just to hold on the... Uh, This part right here. Oh, that should hold it down. Well, they ship them like that so that this thing doesn't come off. I think. So I'm gonna take it off of there because I think it might squish it. So this, this, and this goes back in here. So. But you might have to use that part. Oh no, it's rolling away. Okay. Let me get our handy cyclops. Oh, here. but wait. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, this is what has to happen here. And then I'm going to basically compress the shock enough. Which is going to be difficult because that's why we're going to jack it up a bit. 
Let's use our own handy jack. That's right. And that's what has his name on it. But I don't, you can't really see it. Now yeah, now that gives us some room to uh What's blue? Here, let's get out of there. I don't want your head underneath here. Can't really see it. Okay. Uh let me see. Is there like a reason when you put that in? I don't want you in there. I'm just looking for her. A little bit more. A little, little, little. Make uh. sure, you, make sure you never want to stick. Sometimes, when you're a kid, you never want to stick your head in, in there because you can get your head stuck. Okay, perfect. Got the bolt through. Started. And now time to put the shot on, right? Yeah. yeah. Now you can go through and look if you want to get a camera shot. So there it is. This is the new shot. And if you looked at this one, it's pretty older. Okay, so now, now that's through. And then through the top here. The rubber is through, so we gotta put this and the nylock on. And then tighten the nylock down. Wait, did it just, is it just like the random shoe or something? No, that's a, oh. Whoa, that's a pretty one. Blue set, guys. I did it. Did you connect to or? One. Is this a one stoop? Two one or two twelve inch extensions. Wait, these are these are are these together. Did you put these together? I did, yeah. Did you buy them together or no? No, they they come apart. They're just two twelve inch extensions. Wait, did they come in a pack? Yes sir. Wait, you can wait. He's in that to one plus one. Like this. That is crazy. Oh, it looks so big. It does. It's just super wide. Right. Wait. Is it almost one as long or something? Is it? I feel like we'll have that inch screwdriver. Maybe I'll drop it at the time. Okay. You got the. A blue one, a blue stripe, this stripe. How did I get it out of my mouth? Never mind. That's it. So much are hard for me to remember. Sorry that if you don't want the video no, to be a one. Tighten the other one. Twenty-two. So guys, this video might be a pretty long. I s sometimes I forget to do time lapses or something.
there. I told the world, right? That's it. Hooray. Cool. Awesome. Done. Awesome. Ready? Here we go. <gasps> that was like crazy. I was like, that was like that. That was crazy, so. That's one shock complete. Whoa, that feels way better. Yeah. What? Sure. Well, look at this. Now this side's sitting higher than the other side. Wait. What? Yeah. If you guys can't see it, it's sort of on straight. Can't we really see it? Wait. So straight. What the hell, dude? That is. It's super high because usually when the shot. Well, usually when you have new shots, that means the shots will... Yeah, yeah usually when you have like new shots, the shots lift up higher than the old ones, like this tar. And I, and I agree. And I agree. This one is way dirtier. Well, if you can't really see right here, there's like some flat. So, dad's going to do the other side. What's the, to it? I think I'm just watching him because sometimes you guys might get bored of just watching them and stuff. Well, one time. Okay. And who's this? Sit, strive to our channel. Okay. Because it's very good. Now. I hope Dad hears that. Same drill like we did on the other side. We do the same thing we did on this side. Wait, Dad. Take da the lower bolt off. Wait, Dad, did you get two? Yeah. Or four? <laughs> yeah, because I have some babies to do. Dad, do you have four? What? Do you have four, wait. Do you have four or just four. two? Four? Did he drop your wins? Yes, sir. Oh, you, did you put it up already? I think he did. I think that's a yes. Now to a, what for ready, let's do ready for the other one. Let's jump here or maybe both of them. Or maybe in the back one just here. Yeah, or maybe even the back ones might be new. I don't know. There might be a new one on the dark. Wait, so we'll put Or maybe there's one that's tracked. It was not tracked before. Okay, let's get to it. So. What's he doing? How was it looking? How, how was it looking out there? In there? It's coming around. You wanna look? So, we still have the older one in there. Whoa! This one looks way newer. You didn't see the blue paint? Guys, can you see the blue paint? Those are like the blue. This one has blue paint on it. Yeah. It you does. can't. You can't we really see the other one, guys, so. I'll put the light on it if you want to do more of a shot. So, guys, if you see this one, you can't we really see the blue, but it is there, like up in here or back in here. Does this one, I wish that these shots used to be blue or something. Yeah, they were blue at one point. These are the original shots, believe it or not. Yeah. 17 years old. How old this tar is 17 years old? Yes, sir. Oh. Yeah. And we might have to replace the... This ought to be interesting. <laughs> Got it. Your glue is very loud. It's an impact. Drill. Oh. 
Yeah, that's why it's really loud. Ooh, that got warm. To what that warm? The nut. So this is like the old nut. Yeah. yeah. This is an old nut. That is very old. Like that was the widow nut on the tar yep. too. And guys, if you went over here too, you can see this. This is pretty like green right here. Has a little. Here comes the other shock. Ready? Yeah. Ah! Okay. Ready one. Oh. Go. Oh, I thought you were. Are you in a drill? Whoa. So, guys, this is the other one. Well, that's pretty rusty. Yeah. Look at this. Let's see how much rebound this one's got. Pretty almost good. Pretty almost not good. Shocks are supposed to come up fast. I want to compare them. Yeah, I think they're both the same. You want to race them? You I can race them if you want. You want to see? Well, I want to see what, who has the most lust. Or the most whips in the paint. Okay, let's, let's do a little test here. So, so what we'll do is we'll compress both of these. Which one? Where Let me get this down. Which one is harder? It's about the same. Well, I think the harder one is this one. Yeah, let's compress them both. Okay, wait a minute. Uh. Ready? Yes. Set. Go. Which one's gonna win? I think, I think. Let's get them perfect. I think, wait. Let's watch the camera angle. See so, how slow they are to come back? So. But they're kind of going about the same, aren't they? Yeah. But I think this one was a little harder. Let's watch them and see how fast they come back. Not very fast. What that? Because if you can't really see. Yeah. So, those are bad shots. Shocks are supposed to come back really fast. What? For that. That big one wins. Yeah, that's Guess what. What? what? <laughs> when shocks are complete. Okay. Actually, I think the bad ones went very small. So let's talk about the back shocks. We can get underneath the back and look at it and I'll show you. Now, I think this part we took the. So let's focus on me. Yeah. Okay, let's talk about the back shocks. So on the back shocks of this thing, there are something called Nivor mat socks, uh, dampers, and special springs. Not shocks. You can't shocks. just switch out the shocks because the, sh the springs are actually too soft. So let's go in the garage. I'll show you guys what we got against us here. So these are from the front, and for the back, you have to actually put new springs in. And these are the shocks. And those are the shocks for the rear. So these are Bilstein springs that are replacement and a firmer spring to take out the softer spring in the back. Wait, do we have four of these or we two? We have two of these. Only for and the then back? we have, you, you're not even, if you're gonna be a cameraman, let's be a cameraman. Okay, so these are the shocks for the back. As you can see, the shocks for the back are a little bit different because they actually have two thread, thread holes and they're rather large shocks. So a lot of weight on the back of these things. So that's the, the rear stuff. So let's go underneath the truck and we'll do some, uh, some video here. Underneath the back, right here. Okay, so here's the back of the Suburban. These are the original Nivor mat, which is, I believe, an XV7 suspension package. So uh, these dampers is what they're called, actually. They have springs inside or a spring damper in these shocks, or dampers is what you're supposed to call them. And these uh, springs right here, we're gonna need to replace as well too. So in order to replace the springs, 
of course we're gonna have to undo the shocks and then we're gonna have to lift the body up high enough for those springs to come out so we can just swap out the springs so that should be pretty straightforward well hey guys it's the next day hope you guys enjoyed uh, junior's camera work there while i was switching the bill steins out on the bourbon so we got everything all put in and especially in the rear here as you can see we've got our brand new shocks and springs as well too pretty easy job um very very nice ride and very very happy with the upgrade uh out of all four shocks uh only one of them actually had any kind of rebound left to it um so here's the the pile of shocks and springs as you can see one of them was leaking pretty bad and the other one actually had some rebound in the back but um yeah so those were nivor mat shocks from socks and that was a special handling suspension package for smoother ride but the bilstein uh, springs actually did a really nice job with it as well too so that was the the change out to put a stiffer spring in the rear so hope you guys liked the video we're going to keep doing more work on the suburban and if you want to stay up on latest content subscribe and thanks for watching peace